be around till the end of the video to find out how we created this beautiful circular images slider the ui which is kind of similar to instagram stories just find it out hey guys welcome to reva academy and in this tutorial we are going to look at different types of horizontal list views in flutter and if you like this video please share it with your friends who are also learning flutter so we created a new project in visual studio code and we will remove these extra comments from the default project that is created okay so i will remove these extra comments and i will also remove these two extra classes okay so that we can start with a clean slate and i will create uh, this new class by the same name my home page this is the stateless widget okay by the name my home page and I will remove this title parameter which is not required for now and over here instead of container this will return a scaffold and we will quickly add app bar to this okay app bar app bar say title text and inside the text we will add horizontal list view list view okay now what we will do is run this in our emulator okay so now you can see that this is nicely running in emulator and now we will quickly start by adding the list so first i will add the body and inside the body i will add the list view and i will add the children to this list view okay so i will start by adding a container I will add its attributes like height, width and I will also add the color. Okay. Color is dot blue. Okay. So you can see that um, this container is added over here. So what I will do is I will add one more container, copy the same one. Okay. Right now it will not take the width 100 because our list view is by default to the full screen okay now what I will do is I will change the axis of this to horizontal scroll direction dot this is the parameter which we will add scroll direction axis dot horizontal okay so you can see it has changed this axis to a horizontal okay now let me add some more containers so that you can see the scrolling effect okay so what i will do is i will let me copy paste this both the containers okay so now when i save and hot reload you can see this is horizontally scrolling now okay now now you can see that the height of this is taking the full screen okay so what i will do is i will wrap this to a container I will wrap this list view to a container and I will add a height over here okay say height 150 okay now you can see the height is adjusted okay so in this way you can create the horizontal list view in flutter you just have to add the list view and then add the scroll direction now you can also add the padding if you want okay say so if you add the padding it will look something like this but i think the padding is not looking good okay if you need a i mean if it is a requirement in your project according to the design you can definitely go with this but right now i will remove this property from here okay so this is pretty simple to create you can see how quickly we can create in flutter okay now let us try this with images and to do that what i will do is i will wrap this entire um, list view inside the column so that we can place one more list view just below it okay that is the reason we wrapped it with a column not now what i will do is i will copy this entire thing and i will paste it again but before that i will place a size box in between so that these are not overlapping i mean intersecting with each other okay so there is some space okay size box height 20 okay so this size box will put a space in between okay so when i save and hot reload you can see there are two different list view added over here 
Now instead of this container, I will remove them and I will add images over here. Okay, so uh, we, we can add images by say image.network and you can paste the URL of an image over here. So I will go to pixel.com and I will take any of the random image from here. Okay. So let me take this one. Okay. So what I will do is I will copy the URL from here and I will go back to the project and add the image over here and when I save and hot reload okay just okay yes it is there now okay so if you want to see in detail on how more we can add the image you can check out my previous video now what I will do is I will wrap this image inside the container okay so that I can add other properties like weight to it okay say 50 if I do that you can see the size is changing right now mm, let me do it 150 okay so you can control your height and width like this way you can also wrap this image with a size box to change the height and width okay let me do 100 okay this is good let me put the height also Okay, now what I will do is I will copy this images. Okay, what's okay? There is comma missing. Okay. Now what I will do is I will copy these images one below each other so that they, uh, they will scroll in horizontal view. Okay, but now these images are inter uh, I mean intersecting with each other. So what we will do is space uh, place the size box in between so that there is some space between these images okay of course in the real time applications there will be different images but uh, for this example i am placing the same image okay so yes you can see this is scrolling yes let me put one more okay so you can see that uh, we can put images also inside the list horizontal list view you can place any widget as per your requirement i have made the height 100 so that it looks nicely now what i will do is i will copy this again over here so you can see there is one more horizontal list view added and i will remove uh, uh, i will just keep one image for now okay now what I will do is I will format this document first so that it appears nicely. Okay. And now we will make this image circular. Okay. So to do that there is this box decoration property which I have also discussed in my previous video. You can check that out. Okay. We will do it over here. Okay. So inside the container there is this box decoration property. So for that you have to write decoration, box decoration and inside that we can give border radius. Okay, border radius, border radius dot all and over here radius dot circular. Okay, my screen is small. Okay, I will adjust this thing. Radius dot circular 50. Oh, let me make my screen screen proper. Okay, good. Now you can see. Okay, but it will not change right now because uh, whenever we use this box decoration property, instead of the child, we have to specify this image inside this property. Okay. Okay, I missed one closing okay cool so what i will do is i will comment this child part and i will put my image inside this box decoration okay there is this image property over here i will copy this url 
and over here new decoration image and I will play paste the URL over here image and I will paste the URL okay yes yes there is this compatibility issue so instead of image network over here we have to write network image okay so when we save and hot reload you can see uh, the image appearing over here but and the borders are circular okay now we want to make this full circle and for that I have removed that child below over here okay so to make this image circular there is this fit property fit box fit dot cover and when I do that okay now you can see the image has been changed to the circular right so whenever I uh, do this circular image and it is placed inside this horizontal list view so what I will do is copy the same thing okay and of course with a size box so that there is a space in between okay yes you can see now when you go on cop uh, adding the image to this horizontal list view it will scroll nicely okay so does this UI reminds of you of something yes it looks something like your Instagram stories UI okay so I hope you like this video and if you really did please share it with your friends who are also learning flutter thank you so much for watching